Hello everybody, this is Mohit here and welcome to the test book. Guys, today we have our achiever as a gate rank, All India rank 1 in Electronics and Communication Engineering in this year as a Ram Balaji S. Ram, tell me about yourself. Uh, hello everyone, I'm Ram Balaji. I'm from Metapal and Coimbatore. I'm pursuing my B.Tech in Engineering Physics at IIT Madras. And uh, I'm happy to say that I'm AIR 1 in gate EC paper this year. Okay Ram, so how you feel? Yeah, I'm, result. I'm feeling very proud and happy and all my friends, relatives, parents are feeling very proud and happy as well. Okay, fine. Uh, Ram, uh, you are in final year, right? Yeah. And uh, in this scenario, uh, students are giving gate in third year also, right. and final year also. So are you already appearing for third year? Yeah, I, I have given gate in my third year as well. And uh, during that time, like I wasn't... Uh, like I did not completely cover the entire syllabus, but still like I wanted to give it to know how much knowledge I I have I have uh, regarding the subjects which I have already known. So I in that I got like 56 out of 100, and I think that is really good score. Okay, fine, fine. Uh, that that means in third year you get 56 marks out of 100. Yeah. And the rank of around 128 something. Yeah, it was 120 plus something. 120 plus something. Fine, that's a good, a, a re really good. Uh, Ram, you are doing your graduation in engineering physics. Yeah. Then and giving uh, your gate in electronics and communication. What is the reason <laughs> behind that? So like uh, I had always had an interest in electronics. So in my IIT, I joined in aerospace engineering. At the end of the first semester, like I had good CGPA, so I got branch change into engineering physics so that I could pursue my interest in physics and electronics. Like I can, uh, I can experience both streams and choose which one is like which one I had passion for. And I found out that I had passion for electronics. And then like I I wanted to uh, explore the field of electronics, and I started searching for opportunities in that. So, like during that time, I felt like EP does not have many opportunities in the electrical core domain. So, I wanted to give gate so that I could do my M Tech in electrical engineering at IITs or abroad as well, so that I get more opportunities to pursue my dream. Fine, fine. That's nice, Ram. Uh, Ram, one more thing I want to ask you <coughs> from our users. There, uh, our users, there are so many of our users are from tier two and tier three engineering colleges. Right. And they are, they have a thinking that you are from IIT Madras yeah. and you are definitely placed in any company. Then why should you want to give gate? <laughs> right. Because you have job only. Right. They don't have any job. These are the, uh, th this is the mainly thinking of tier two and tier three colleges of India. Yeah, even like before my placement process, I wasn't sure enough that I would get placed and that is why I was preparing for parallelly for GATE as well so that I could do my M Tech. But uh, like luckily I got placed and like out of my efforts I got placed and uh, but still I wanted to give GATE so because it is valid for three years, right? Okay. I can use it for, for my future as well. Yeah, yeah. That means uh, first initially you have to join your company right, right now. Yeah. Uh, that is your uh, future aspect and after gate is already valid for three mm -hmm. years so in one two two three year also you can go for m tech yeah if i am interested i can go for m tech as well fine in which company you placed it uh, i got placed in texas instruments texas instruments good 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 okay ram uh, ram in final year yeah uh, already there are so many students in final year appearing for gate and they have their semester mm -hmm. examination their viva their projects and how can you manage this this time with your preparation yeah, like I had my research internship going on, like I had my classes going on and then like I was preparing for gate, I was preparing for placements. So like what I did was I clubbed these things together. So like I took courses like uh, related to the gate preparation thing, like digital IC design, communication systems and like the uh, placement process like it was mostly analog and digital profile. So I club, I started preparing for gate initially with analog and digital profiles, uh, analog and digital systems. So by that I was able to manage time. Yeah. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, Ram. Uh, Ram, you got 78 marks this year. Yeah. Okay. Uh, when you know about test book, actually there are so many organizations in this country. Uh, they can prepare for gate and EAC aspirants yes. and uh, how can you know about test book actually? I came to know about test book through my college uh, emails and they were conducting lots of test series and uh, they were giving out prizes and 
they were conducting more events to involve people, to involve students to get more about uh, all these exams. Uh, so uh, I was one of the students who got attracted by these test series. Okay. And like on, uh, I also like enrolled in the gate select program. Okay. Yeah. So that is how I got into test book. But the gate select program is mostly taught in Hindi. Right. But the notes are provided in English and you are you are not able to understand hindi yeah then how can you cope up with that so i i i can i wasn't able to focus hindi but still like when the professors uh, when the teachers were writing it uh, i was able to understand the concepts very well fine 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 okay okay Ram, Ram. then the uh, mock test are helpful for your preparation yeah like uh, after every class there used to be a mock test and at the end of every every subject, uh, there used to be a subject test. So it helps in evaluating ourselves uh, if we had understood the concept well, or if we had understood it wrongly. It it gives a chance for us to correct things. So so and also like there used to be a full subject test and also full length mock test. So th these were very helpful like because like they were like giving a real gate exam, sitting for three hour long and giving them. So that will help in time management. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, Ram, this year in GATE, uh, there is a very controversial question among the students. Yeah. Even in teachers, in mm -hmm. between teachers also. Uh, that is the doping of collector and base. Yeah, right. Uh, uh, is that question your correct or wrong? Yeah, I got it correctly. Uh, like, the collector is lightly doped. This this was actually an interesting story. It, like, this, this happened during my discussion in my classes. On, uh, the professor was telling that collector is slightly doped and we had a discussion and that is how, that is why I was able to do that correctly. Fine, fine. Interesting, interesting. Okay, Ram. Uh, Ram, in a test series, yeah. uh, basically uh, you get you give some mock test, full length and sleep subject wise and in main exam you get 78 marks. Yeah. Uh, so, is there any difference between the marks of mock test and uh, in your uh, real examination? Uh, that is like, uh, if I tell you won't believe it, like my uh, accuracy in the test book thing was 77.6 percent and my marks in gate was 78 percent. Okay, nice. So that was very close. Very close. Okay, fine, fine. Okay. Uh, Ram, in your preparation, in your, yeah. this, uh, your preparation before gate, there are so many students, uh, they are demotivated mm -hmm. in the month of January before mm -hmm. gate, in December, they are not able to study properly mm -hmm. and again demotivated, they are not able to revise subjects, they are not able to complete their subjects, mm -hmm. some formulas they are not able to remember. So is there anything uh, faced by you? Yeah, actually like after December I got place and like uh, then I felt like, uh, like I lost the motivation I had before the placements to prepare for the gate exam okay. and also I had several other personal problems as well. So like uh, for one or two months I wasn't able to focus properly on the gate preparation but still like if when you have interest for something and like you are prepared like so, so long for the gate exam and the last one or two months it shouldn't uh, like be a barrier to what you are going to achieve, right. So on, only that thing kept me uh, still motivated to still keep going even though I had so many problems around me I still uh, persisted and I remained uh, focused on what what should be done correct correct yeah that means uh, last months are definitely very crucial for your preparation because you yeah. prepare for a long year mm -hmm. and if you are not able to focus on the last two months then there is a waste of time right that, that is and a waste yeah. of preparation also your uh -huh. mental temperament is also gone bad in examination right Okay, yes, yes. Okay, Ram. Ram, uh, in, uh, you ca can you give some uh, statements or give some information to our students who are currently in third year and in final year want to prepare for GATE? Because in this country, in our country, they are in tier 2 and tier 3 colleges, there is no placements, mm -hmm. first thing. And if there is no placement, the students are targeting and giving uh, attempt for the GATE. You are yeah. already from IIT. Right. And students right now want to go to IIT for masters. Mm -hmm. So is, is, is there is a correct uh, option for that or they should try other things also? Yeah, like uh, GATE is a like, very important thing. Like it provides many opportunities. You can go into PSUs as yes, well yes. and few other abroad universities like in Singapore and Ger yes. Germany as well. They they accept GATE scores. Yes. So, if you, I think it is important for every one of you to give GATE exam, at least give a try. We may not know how, uh, how we will end up. Like, 
I gave a try and I, I was shocked even like in my first attempt I got 56 and that kept me motivated. So like giving an attempt first is, uh, f it, it is very important to at least participate. Yes, yes. Don't think about results. Yeah, first right. you have to participate. Yeah. Then if not getting good rank, again. Right. You, rank. you can always improve from where you are. Yes, yes. Definitely, definitely. Okay, Ram. So thank you very much. Our, yeah. uh, our students are definitely getting motivated by your statements. Yeah, I would uh, like to say one yes, one yes, thing. Yeah, sure, sure. Like when you start preparing, uh, you you there are many formulas, so you don't try to memorize them, but please try to understand the concepts very well. So if you try to understand them, then it will it will be easy for you as well to prepare. You needn't like, memorize everything. We are not computers, right? We are humans. So I think that thing that that should be one takeaway from me that will be helpful in your preparation as well. Thank you, Ram. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much.